With their car still running, two men were found dead outside of Baptist Health last night. Little Rock Police is now investigating the double homicide, and THV 11's Sarah Herbakowitz has the latest. Little Rock Police are investigating a double homicide after shots were fired here on the corner of John Barrow and 36. Now, the stores in the area were all closed before the time of the shooting, but now customers are starting to fill in some of the details and share what they know as police look for more answers. The Sunshine Mart along John Barrow closed Sunday night, just hours before police report shots fired. Yeah, I closed yesterday at like 10, 30, 10, 25. Employee Mohammed Hassan didn't witness the shooting, but it still had a big impact on him. When I came to the work, I see the people say somebody died, somebody died, somebody died. Monday, customers told Mohammed that one of his friends was a victim in Sunday's double homicide. He liked my friend. For real, he came here every day and we talk together and he paid food from here. Early reports show that police responded to a call at Baptist Hospital close to midnight Sunday. That's when two men were found dead, likely with gunshot wounds in their car that was still running. But once police arrived, that's the part that's kind of fuzzy. A third victim showed up to the hospital for a gunshot wound in his leg. What I understand is they were able to ascertain some more information based off of a third victim showing up. Sunday night follows a trend of rising crime across the city and the nation. According to LRPD, homicides increased by 24% over the last year, with this investigation marking the 62nd and 63rd homicides in 2021. When you get a phone call that there are two possibly deceased males in a vehicle, then you really, at that point, try to figure out what's happening. This as community members just hope for more peace. Careful. Don't kill anybody. I mean, that's not play. That's not game. Officials are still working to notify the next of kin of the victims, and police are expecting more information from the coroner's report that they expect later this week. For now, reporting in Little Rock, Sarah Bakowitz, THV 11 News. Sarah, thanks so much. If you have information on what happened or who was involved, Little Rock police are asking you to give them a call. If your tip leads to a murder arrest and conviction, you could be eligible for a $10,000 reward.